Hi, I'm Los Vogels Sharp. Today's December 26th, 2017. Um, I'm here by the water with a message to Mr. President Trump again. And the father said to me this morning as I was receiving this, this is the second message that is being sent out to him from God, directly, directly from the father. I'm just going to read it. Uh, he also told me to tell America, you need to fast and pray that this law gets reversed because America is never going to be blessed until this happens and judgments will continue to happen. He mentioned the hurricanes and he said there are other judgments coming. So, Mr. President Trump, you may not believe in the gifts of the Holy Spirit and that there are true prophets speaking for God in this world, but you will if you do not yet. It is time, sir, the man I chose to bring America back to me to fix the wrong that your Supreme Court has done. Abominations in my sight are exactly what they are called. And when I sit and look down upon the nation that once was walking before me in righteousness and now has decided to take the position of what feels right to man rather than what I say is correct, you will surely suffer the consequences for all the babies whose lives were thrown away as if they never existed. I say to you, Mr. President Trump, the man that I chose, you must start listening to their cries from the ground where they were thrown away as garbage. I have lost children who were to make their mark in history for my glory, and they were murdered without ever accomplishing their mission on the earth. How many more of my children will be barbarically ripped out of the womb because the laws of your land have given the okay to do it. Man will follow blindly when told to move forward and fall into the ditch if there is no one to tell them to stop. It is time to tell the people to stop killing their babies. My babies, made in my image and likeness. The next judgment on America is about to take place and it will cause an issue on your economy that you are so proud of right now. No greatness will ever return to America without my blessing. And I tell you, Mr. President Trump, that until this sin of outright murder that has been allowed as acceptable is stopped, my judgments will continue. The hurricanes did not shake you enough. Will the earthquake and the volcanoes wake you up to right this wrong? Your economy is about to crash and will you see that I have spoken to stop the killing of my creation? Your Father, who art in heaven, and I am awaiting your response. That's what I got. I have nothing else to say to that because this has nothing to do with me or our ministry. This has to do with the message that's sent to the president and those in authority that can start moving forward to right this wrong. God is not looking down at America, looking to let us be blessed and have everything la-di-da when we are continuing to murder. They know for a fact now that life begins in the womb. Therefore, life that is snuffed out in the womb is actual murder. It's murder. We have to stop this. Christians, we have to rise up and stop this in whatever way we can. Start calling the White House. Get on the internet and get some phone numbers and start calling. Start sending letters. Start getting positions with people signing it. We have to show the president, our president, and those that put the laws out that we do not want this in our country anymore. Take our stand because God does not like this and this is not good. So I'm Lois Vogelshop and I'll be back again when the Lord sends me back again to say whatever he wants me to say. So, Father, please make the way for these messages to get to our president and whoever else needs to hear them so that we can right this wrong and, and then be forgiven by you so that you can heal our land. And we pray, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, for this to get out across the land, for the people to rise up and begin to pray and fast so that this can be accomplished. In Jesus' name, amen.